So what is open source networking? In this video, first we're gonna define white boxes, then we're gonna define what open source networking is, then we're gonna quickly look at what the difference between white boxes and open source networking is. Then we're gonna discuss some of the players that are involved in the Open Compute project. And then we're gonna look at some different types of open source products and services. So first we have the definition of white box computing. It's a very simple definition. It is the commodity hardware upon which the software can run. It pertains specifically to the hardware. Then the definition of open source networking. And this is actually a combination of a few things. It includes the commodity white box hardware, as well as the open source operating systems and software, and the implementation of open source industry standards. And then another definition that I've seen is it's the overall initiative to produce networking products based on open source standards and software. All right, and just to directly compare them, the white box refers to the commodity hardware only, while open networking describes the entire effort concerning open source networking, which includes the software, the hardware, and the standards. The next thing to note is that open networking is completely taking off. Many of the open source solutions are improving rapidly and becoming enterprise grade. There are easy to implement turnkey systems that are designed for automation. And open networking software runs on bare metal white box devices that can handle networking at scale. And then there's also the Open Compute Project, which is a formal initiative involving some of the biggest tech companies in the world, including Facebook, Google, AMD, Intel, and Cumulus. And then there's also a really good Packet Pushers article that we're going to go through right now. So here we have a really good article on PacketPushers.net. So this top one here, Netbox has a really good management tool. This network reliability engineering is a really good learning source, and I recommend that everybody check it out. And of course, there's OpenFlow. Quagga focuses on routing. And there's Bird and Go BGP as well. OpenV switch focuses on a virtual switch. And then OINE is an open install environment for bare metal network switches. And then we have Open Network Linux, which is a Linux distribution for bare metal switches. And then Open Switch is an open source Linux based network operating system platform. And then they briefly discuss the Open Compute project that we already talked about. Facebook is one of the more famous participants there. And then there's a few other interesting links here as well, and I recommend you check them out if you are interested. All right, so in this video, we defined white boxes, we defined open source networking, we looked at the difference between the two, and then we looked at the different types of open source products and services that are being worked on right now. All right, if you found this helpful, please consider liking and subscribing, and with that, I will see you in the next video.